Oh, man. Don't want to hit these guys. Especially since we go into a room that really I'm not looking forward to. Mm, boom, boom. Okay. Link, watch out. The ceiling is falling down. Holy God. Okay. Hold on. Ah, oh, I just missed. Got him. Come on, ceiling. Waiting for you to fall back down. Wait, what? Uh. Hmm. That's just great. Ow. Let's just get this. More arrows that we really don't need. Wait a minute. I did it again. I purposely did that because there's a thing over here. I keep forgetting about it. Which leads to a door. Hold on. I fucking tell me I shouldn't be doing this. Treasure chest. I think a gold scatula is down there, but we just make sure it's not up here. What to do? What to do? Whatever. It's right here. You know what? It'd be better if I did this. So I don't waste any arrows. Excuse me. And this better be worth it. A recovery heart? What? All that for a heart. I mean, we did get the gold Cthulhu. I am aiming to get all 100 of those. Ah. Oh. As you see, the blue and yellow... Uh, flames are back, so just that means we did get two of them. Unfortunately, now I gotta go all the way back to the. Uh... Come on, man! I don't want to deal with you right now. I really don't. So die. Wait. Thank you. Had that saying, we have to go all the way back to that checkered fallen floor room. Uh, let me think. I think I can just... It's not really that far. I don't know. You know what? I'll just keep, I'll just keep going, I guess. Here we go. I already hit the switch. The door's already unlocked. It looks like I hit it again. I mean, they should really... But they should really give you more than a recovery heart for, for that one treasure chest that's there. Alright, we're back at the Twisted Room. Okay, let me think here. Um... Almost there. Open the door! Rolling, rolling, rolling. Here we go. This is it. That didn't take the long to get here. Here we go. Back in this room. Door's still unlocked. We'll just head to the switch. Wait for it to fall down again, and then we'll head to the treasure chest. Actually, I might be able to make it from here. Let's check it out. Got it. So now here we are, as you see another picture, 
shoot it. But this is going to be a little different. This time we got to actually move these blocks to make the guy. Wait, no. Go like this. Don't be stupid now. Alright, I'm just going to move this up here. And obviously we have a set time limit here. I gotta move it a little more. That should be good. Okay. Almost got it. Almost there. I don't think you need that other one. Which you don't. So that's gone. It's pretty much the same thing as the other ones. And the fourth one is going to be different. And you'll see in just a second, because actually right after this guy, we fight the fourth one. The purple one. What's down? Dead. That one moves, like, dominates this whole, uh, these whole, these pose here. And the door opens. Here we go. Uh, arrows. And once again, they expect you to use the arrows, but... I'm not gonna waste my arrows. We only have 30 of them. Like, use the hookshot if, if it's easier. And this door will lead us to the other side. The east side of the original room. And if you look, there's our purple. Hold on. DIE! Oh man, I guess you can't do that. Anyway, let's go fight this guy. So here we go. It's purple fighting USA time, people. Uh, but he changes into four guys. What are we gonna do? Well, the one that spins is the one you hit. Now, I saw the spin at the, as soon as the, it started, so that's why I was able to do it. But you see how he spins, and that's who you shoot. So this isn't really that hard. I would recommend using your arrows here. It may take longer, but it's a lot easier, I think. There he is. There they are. Like, what, like what's taking them so long? Die! There you go. See, not that hard. Arrows will come out as always. Purple flame in place. Elevator up, ball game over, Forest Temple over, Link wins. Of course, we're not quite done yet. Now, in this little corridor, we have a treasure chest that's on the other side of this wall. Uh, there's a gold scotula somewhere in one of these hallways as well. So, we're just going to push it in the same direction. So, we're just going to push it this way first. And whatever comes open, that's what, what we're going to check out. So, let's check it out. We have a switch here, so let's hit it. This switch is going to open a door somewhere. And that's all we can really do. So let's push it again, and I'm here in the gold scotula as I push that. And looks like we got another switch. Let's hit it. And that opens another area that we can't really see where we're, where, 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 where we're opening, but still, we opened something. Alright. What else do we have here? Um. Big Scatula, right? Oh, this is called Scatulas. I guess their big title is not present, because we're big now. And we get an arrow. How exciting. And here's our fifth Gold Scatula of the Forest Temple. Let's just make sure I'm correct about that statement. I am.
And that gives us a total of 51 gold Cthulhu's. So, on our way back to Kakariko Village, we'll get the prize. Alright. Um. No, we gotta push it one more time. We gotta push it one more time, I believe, to get to where we need to go. And then I think that's getting, that's obviously going to do it. Uh, no, wait. That's another switch. The switch that opens the boss door area. Okay. And there it is. As you see, there's a giant key, but we got it. The big key. So that didn't take that long. That only took three videos, actually. <laughs> My prediction of ten may have come short. Maybe a little short, because obviously... Now it's time to do the Master Quest, uh... Whoa, what? Whoa. That's weird. Door disappears, and then reappears. Disappears, and reappears. Anyway. So that's gonna end the video off here. Uh, the next video will be the Master Quest version of, uh, the Forest Temple. Uh, okay. So this is Jersey Gamer 9000 saying so long, everybody, and I'll see you next time when we start the Master Quest version of this dungeon. Or temple.